What's up YouTube? Today we are watching The Burnt Chips Come Dine With Me Part 2 and I hope I learned something because this is all I've eaten in the last two days plus some cheese sticks and some cereal so I need to learn how to cook some food, that's for sure. See you there. Welcome to YouTuber Come Dine With Me. Take the five most finished YouTubers. I'm stuck! Ask each of them to throw a dinner party. <laughs> Then get them to score each other in secret. It was appalling. Was that the... Whatever it is. Wait, what's his name? The robot thing from Star Wars? It was shocking and it was miserable. Previously, Chris <laughs> and he hosted a haunting evening. Do we need to season for you? Filled with more tricks than treats. I can't be asked to go Tonight, Alpha TV is your captain. Stand back. For a journey <laughs> through time and space. Alpha, you've set... Fire to I something. feel like Arthur's gonna slay this for real. As they contest for the legendary title of YouTuber Come Dine With Me. Arthur's journey through time. It's a way you could describe his dating life as well, but let's not go too into that. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that's so funny. Guys, I'm pretty sure Arthur's dating this like British girl. Who's like 18. Or is it? No, okay. I should probably say, I should probably do my research on this, but I don't want to because I don't care enough. But Hello I'm there. pretty sure he's dating, allegedly, allegedly he's dating a pretty young girl. She's like a, she's also an influencer. She like does makeup. I don't know her name. Um, but so there's like a lot of jokes when it comes to like age and him dating and stuff. Cause like she is really young. What's the menu? Great thought behind this. Okay, let's start off with a cocktail. Arthur lays the foundations of life with his cocktail, The Big Bang. The Big Bang. Arthur's parents will know all about that one. He's got like eight siblings. 13 oh my God. billion years ago, the universe came from nothing. Just like this cocktail. It's the beginning of everything. I feel like there could have been a better description for that. You're not giving me any clues now, I'll be honest. What is the beginning <laughs> of everything? Maybe he's just dripped a bit of his sperm in there. He's like Ew. a freak when it comes to drinking as well. He loves just getting people drunk and asking them, out of 10, how drunk are you? Not looking forward to the Big Bang. Let's start the day by getting <laughs> everyone drunk. Oh my goodness, there's so much. Okay. Premium lemonade. Chip got a sponsor for this video. So I think we're just going to make something that tastes really nice, bombard it with alcohol and add some dry ice in it and hope it doesn't kill anyone. Wait, we'll dry ice? Syrup, That's cool. water and sugar. And Wait, yeah. he's like being legit about this. He's like actually being... See, this is so much better than the beta squad ones because the beta squad ones I like did not cook. Bunch of mint leaves. Start over medium heat. Well, I've never used dry ice myself before. I don't know how much I'm supposed to put in. We'll give Theo the most. And if he survives, everyone else will survive. Oh, it already smells nice. <laughs> oh. Okay, I've already made a mistake. So we're cooking the mint leaves, which we're not supposed to. Okay, maybe I'm gonna take her out. It needs to be refrigerated, so this actually, the prep time on this is way longer than I thought. What does muddle mean? Hmm, so turn off the heat, add some mint leaves. There we go. Not bad, so now I've just gotta wait for 15 minutes. Who needs 13.8 billion years, eh? What alcohol <laughs> have we got? Have we only got that? <laughs> True steak, true. Yeah, can we get vodka instead, please? I, I don't drink vodka. Vodka. I, I had a terrible night. Now, whilst Arthur rambles on about why he prefers vodka over rum, <laughs> I'm gonna go use my Revolut to fetch him some ingredients. Tonight is all about time. And as we know- Dude, I this group's ad integrations are always so good. They're just, they're so good. First transaction, link in the description. I'm gonna get started with a starter. Next up, <laughs> Arthur arranges his starter. Prehistoric Ew. picky bits. Are Prehistoric bugs? picky bits. That's really That's gross. Like that does met. not sound appetizing whatsoever. And we were apes. Time to eat like one of your ancestors. I don't think he needs to bring my family into it. What is it? And food, I'm guessing. I like the tension though. What did we used to eat ages ago? No idea, so I'm gonna go like scotch eggs, um, cocktail sausages. Stuff like that, you just pick up. Okay, so what? a billion years have passed, and now ancient apes are starting to walk upright. Homo erectus eats grapes. Actually, they're cavemen, they can pick Oh, like a like a charcuterie apples. board. Do we actually we should not prepare? Uh. In nature, some apples are bruised. That's true. Video. Monkey nuts. There we go. A classic misconception that we came from monkeys. 
I'd be so mad if I was to sit down and I was waiting for food and someone brought me peanuts, full apples, and grapes. I'd be so mad. God, I'm getting it cooking. The main ingredient and why this is more fun than just a plate of nuts and fruit is insects. These apparently have a delicate walnut flavor. Oh my God, I've got to remove the wings and legs first. Oh, I don't know how I feel about this. Oh my word. <laughs> they smell really nice, actually. Actually, it could, it could just be the wood. Wow, they're quite <laughs> intimidating to look at. Oh, they've got a weird stickiness to them. Uh, this just does feel like I'm desecrating them. The poor guys. Look him in the eyes and tell him you don't feel bad for him. That's just, it. that's so gross. Oh my God. This is 48% protein. That is literally like protein powder. This thing's not gonna fit me after these. Why do we not eat these more? I'm gonna Google where they eat grasshoppers just so I can say it and make it look like I know. <laughs> you know, a bit of general knowledge for you. In Thailand, <laughs> Central America, Mexico, places like that. They actually eat grasshoppers, so we should learn from them. Really? Oh, I know that. Just one of those facts that I have stored in the old noggin. <laughs> <laughs> the boys are right. <laughs> Mr. Television begins his nightly ritual by unpacking the modern man's meat. His main course. The modern man's meat. Come on. Celebrate the discovery Come of on. fire with a good old steak. That's not what I was hoping for. I've got a feeling that one could be a steak. Hands up if I'm wrong. A steak is the key to a man's heart. But the question is, Will it be cooked properly? If it goes well, it goes well. If he fucks up though, he'll know about it. Okay, potato time. Oh, these are old. Wow, it sprouted a new seed and got mold. One it. time I had a bag of potatoes up in my kitchen and they were above the cupboards. Like they were like, like kind of hidden. And we were like, dude, the, the kitchen smells disgusting. The kitchen smells like actually disgusting. Like it smells like something died, like a rat, like a dead rat. I don't know if you guys have ever smelled a dead rat before, but I have, and they don't smell good. Um, but we were like searching around for it. And all of a sudden we saw this like goo that was going down the side of the cupboard. And it was from these potatoes that were so old that they were turning into liquid. It was disgusting. It was vile. Oh my God, I almost puked over it. How long these are? If they don't taste good, that's the only reason. We've got rosemary and goose fat, which are like the nicest things you could possibly put on a potato. So hopefully they mask the fact that they're a little bit old. <laughs> oh, what's that for? Ah, oh, strain out the mint and put it into a jar. How many cocktails is this supposed to make? I could be cooking for one. Yields one serving. I oh, made one no. cocktail worth. That's so stupid of me. Oh right, okay. no. Let's do that all over again. Oh, I'm not supposed to heat the mint. I've made the same <laughs> twice in a row. God, cooking is hard. Now I get why Gordon Ramsay's angry all the time. You're not supposed to cook the bloody mint. Strainage part two. It's got to go in the fridge for a week. So, time for some time traveling. See week? you next Thursday. Let's get back to the potatoes. What? So we're going to slice these into slices. God, these feel weird. Yeah, they don't look right on the inside. Hey Siri, the potatoes go off. Potatoes can cause food poisoning. Okay, what? now it's time no. to fatten them up. Come on, in you get. Oh. I need some salt, pepper, extra virgin Respect olive oil. Respect for him and going forward with ingredient it. ingredient by a mile, the goose fat. Oh my goodness, the stuff this does to potatoes is magic. We'll toss some rosemary in there for good measure. Oh, it already smells so nice. They are actually, I think, gonna steal the show over the fine steaks we have. As Arthur continues messing around, his first Ooh. guest arrives. I wonder if I'm the first here. Oh, someone's here. Dang, that's a Yo, nice house. It's the main man, come in. Why are you dressed like that? I'm a caveman. You have such ripe shoulders. Ripe for what? <laughs> so, today's theme is a journey through time. And, I have a costume for you. I think cavemen are like usually naked. Yeah. You're gonna be going back a thousand years to the Vikings. Oh, wow. Yeah. Wait, that's Vikings. cool. He has costumes for everyone. Children, and they were very sexist. <laughs> <laughs> Fits you perfectly then. What? <laughs> <laughs> He's not wrong. Do you want to put it on for me? Okay. <laughs> it's hard to tell when the joke finishes with Chip. Maybe he was being serious. Oh my god, it's huge! I think Arthur will be He's a very sensual man, you know, when I see him, two kisses on the cheek, squeeze. We're like in love without being in love. If I was gay, it would be for Arthur. But Aww. I'm not gay. 
Or is that not thick? The guests have started to arrive. I need to make sure I've got everything as prepped as possible so I don't have to do that much cooking because I'm also doing my own entertainment. So now, time to prepare the steaks. A lot of steaks take two and a half minutes on each side. These bad boys are fat and there's five of them. Fat oh, steak. Look at that mm. glorious slab of meat. Exactly the words I uttered to his mother last night. Keeping children in here, are we, Arthur? They haven't gotten out again, have they? Arthur, <laughs> stop! Oh my god, you are unnecessarily caked up. <laughs> oh my word. Send me back to the day Arthur was conceived. <laughs> Go back to the time when you were conceived and you'll find your mum with me. This is so wow. satisfying. Oh, we haven't cuddled yet. We kind of did when we first came in. Okay. No, it wasn't long enough. Okay. I've heard that too many times. Arthur's got a nice <laughs> back, hasn't he? Didn't know he had that kind of money. Ah. So yeah, this is a door. really nice house. Hello, this is welcome. so cute. A wolf in sheep's clothing. Am I right? <laughs> what are you dressed as? Welcome are you to my dinner party. A journey through time. <laughs> no one's going to ever tell me that I'm unnecessarily caked up. Never. I'll never reach that point. It's crap. Come in. Let's get you out of those clothes. As a man who gets injured a lot, you are a war veteran. Size large because you put on some timber this winter. Oh, fucking hell. Arthur. <laughs> of wars. So I'm dressed as a British soldier. No thanks to myself. This is Arthur's <laughs> idea, not mine. Well, well, oh my God, brother. You do not look good. With your blonde hair and blue eyes, that is mental. Oh is yeah, crazy. true. That is a mental thing for you to wear. CP1 is actually a British Child. regiment. Do you want to see something actually quite cool I can do? See the flame? <laughs> yeah. The flame of Asgard. Wow. Oh, you fuck freaking, that was weird. That, was, that hurt, didn't it? Nope. <laughs> 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 oh my god. Oh, we all burn him. I'm burning love. Can you sit there? No. Why is Elvis, Elvis on this ready. table? It's looking good. Just Chris and Morgan Burt whistle to arrive now, and uh, the party can get started. What a lovely day. This humble abode. Looks like our next guest is here. Uh, Hello. Oh, you look like shit. To, uh, what? <laughs> Sorry, ma'am. Remember how nice I was when I greeted you at the door? Bronies hit the gym. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm okay. Yeah. <laughs> no, come in. Yeah, welcome to a Journey right, Through Time. On, You're our man from the future. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah, cover up your ugly mug. Not cool, man. Come on, keep the attention up. So he's a bit of a control freak. <laughs> keep the attention up. He has potential to push his buttons, but he does love it, so I think he'll do quite well. Wow. Oh. Christopher has joined You're us. You actually look really cute in that. I don't know why. Thank you. <laughs> you know that like, wholesomeness to RTD2 where you're like, Cute, wholesome, also you kind of want to find a hole in the robot to what? fuck it. He's cute. <laughs> what? <laughs> What? What did he just say, bro? What the hell? <laughs> now this is not the end. It is not even the beginning of the end, but it is perhaps the end of the beginning. Hitler's speech is translated to English. <laughs> As a famous Churchill quote. Have you shaved? You actually look good in that, Theo. You genuinely yeah. do. You actually, you look like you're coming off the back of a stint where you've got like a mad KD. A propaganda poster of you in World War II would go stinky hard. That's true. <laughs> you've always looked like you had trench foot. I'm, I'm, I'm back. <laughs> uh, we won't be leaving early this week. We've not got a train to catch. And to be fair, I think Arthur has arrived on time. Uh, let's go and see. Couldn't be any later than Chris, though, because that was appalling. A three hours for some pumpkin soup. It was shanked. Intimidating knock. That is quite a big knob. <laughs> <laughs> that is. About mine. That's so weird. Hello. Come back later, or? Yay! Oh my my favourite ginger man. Come on in. What are you wearing? That church remember pool skulls exists. So, second favourite ginger. <laughs> I'll take it. I'll take Come it. on. How's it going? I'm really good. Welcome. Good to see you. Currently, we've got me, caveman. Yep. We've got a Viking. We've got a robot from the future. Okay. We've got a World War II vet, by the way. Don't ask me which side he was on in World War II. <laughs> <laughs> you are a modern day alpha man Gen Z. Come on. Oh, you can wow. stay in your normal character and hate women. And you think I'm wearing this? Put them on anyway. Oh, we'll see wow. you in the dining room momentarily. I, I don't know what my costume is. I've been told to put this hat on. It looks like a skater hat for a 12 year old. I've been told to wear these, like, genuinely. Like, I think HMV went out of business because they sold these. And he's put me in some tight blue shorts. Oh, oh <laughs> Damn, that's actually what like all British guys look like though. 
That I I swear I was I saw British guys walking around in that fit when I was over. Orange. <laughs> <laughs> so cocktail time. Okay, so I'm gonna garnish the glasses. A couple of mint leaves in each one. I think these cocktails are actually gonna be really nice. Vodka. Start off everyone off on a, a nice double. Yeah, that would be good. So who is that guy that just Dude, makes videos? Dude, Arthur's like, like doing really well with this. How like you're a slave. <laughs> this <style>. feels bad. <laughs> There's this guy that basically makes these videos and- George Clark and Arthur TV, the kings of being gray on our other people's channels, damn. That's so fun, cause I was literally gonna say that like Arthur needs to make more content, like content like this on his own channel cause he do really well. It says Theo's fitness challenges are all pointless and he's just saying what everyone's thinking. <laughs> he says Theo's a slave to the system. He's yeah. killing himself what? just <laughs> Which is true. He's doing 75 hard. Yeah, that was cringe as fuck. Yeah, I agreed. That was cringe. No, that was, was cringe. cringe. Yeah, yeah. That was, yeah. was it? Yeah. yeah. Reading yeah, a book, yeah. get a fucking life. You did all of that for what? What you gained out of it? Okay, you go gym every day, you're still fat. Damn. Oh, I'm not. Arthur. Damn. 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 Yeah. <laughs> My dads are fighting. No, pictures don't count. I've just seen his dick. I've just seen, I've genuinely just seen his dick. I've just seen his dick. <laughs> Fat. Two oh my god, that's that's actually messed up. That's actually they're so mean to him. That poor man just gets made fun of. This. Let's chunk two chunks of strawberry in each one. Can I just ask why there's pictures of Elvis? Um, it's a journey through time, isn't it? And Elvis was like back in the day. We'll get MJ. With the dry ice. I'm just going to fill this. That is so That's so cool. cool. Oh Welcome my god. To the drinks. Oh, oh, where's Theo? Oh, Theo's. Um, Who cares? These. Oh my god, that's oh, actually amazing. really good. Oh, Are my big bang cocktails. Big bang cocktails. Theo, look at this. Theo, look at these. Look at these. How sick that actually is. Getting flashbacks to the grenades here, aren't you? <laughs> oh. I need a minute. <laughs> I'm going to have to use a second <laughs> tray, which I wasn't planning on doing. Oh my god, it's hot. Really hot. Why have you still got your pants on? How are the cocktails? Are they nice? I haven't tried them. Not tried them. Oh. Chris is doing a big dirty stinking shit. Yeah. As it stands, this could be a strong contender for a 10 out of 10. We've Ooh. Yeah, yeah, we've, done no, well, like, we've already done the I'm drinks. happy with the theming. I'm happy how you've dressed Theo. Yeah. Bit of dry ice. You can turn some strawberries into. Well, and you know what, though? It looks nice. Yeah, to be fair, I haven't tried it yet. I'm gonna add some more dry ice for some fun because it does look cool. Thank God I came back through. I completely thought these were in the oven. Now I should restart the timer. Some lemonades and vodka lemonades. How so big is this clean. house? This Thank place you, is huge. Definition of a neek. Respect a man who puts Don't in the hard work. Don't be conned by some fucking dry ice. Can you cheer up? Yeah. Oh my God, I'm about to go to war. What's there to be happy for about? For the baddies. Unless it's horrible. in Turkey and he can get a head transplant while he's there. Well, you get oh. one new haircut and you can come with a hair, Joe. Seriously. <laughs> Bros in the trenches, am I right? 13.8 <laughs> oh, billion years ago, the universe Dude. started with a bang. Here's to tonight starting with a bang. Hey. Cheers. Oh, Mate, oh, this is good. That's a really is good it, what is it, mojito? It's a syrup that's basically just sugar and water with mint. It's lemonade and a bit I of don't strawberry. Like it. I don't that know. is really Damn. nice. Don't reveal your secrets, pal. You That's good. You put too much lemonade in it. The Big Bang Damn. definitely started off. Theo's on one this video. What is up with him? How I hope. I'm pretty impressed. I'm a bit of a slut for a sweet cocktail, and it was very good. The presentation was top notch. It was absolutely fantastic with the smoke. Instantly thinking he's put a lot of effort in here. It actually looked really cool and I think the boys liked it. Uh, too much lemonade for my liking though. We weren't an alcoholic free option, so we'll have to mark him down for that. It could only oh, go down true. from here, to be honest. It's looking good. True. Right, so the starter's ready. Now for the secret ingredient. About a million years ago. Oh, fuck oh, is that? Oh. Arthur. Homo erectus was tearing it up on the plane. This can't be your starter. That is, are you okay. taking the piss? Yeah. I do feel like that's a cheating starter. I do. I do. I feel like it's too easy. That's too easy. Like there, there's like no cooking involved in it. You've actually just got peanuts. I swear you get this in the hotel lobbies. This is horrific. I see you okay. probably noticed there's a gap here. Yeah. <laughs> and so all of this is quite basic, you know, nuts, fruits, that yeah. kind of stuff. <laughs> All humans actually got a lot of their protein before fire was made, because fire wasn't made until the main course, from insects. <laughs> you can fuck right No, no Arthur, chance. you haven't. So, Don't you dare. Yeah. He oh just pulled him out of his pop protein. pocket. What, what the hell? Oh, oh my god, yeah. that is not happening. That that is not now, in Central Wait. America, 
in Thailand, in lots Ooh, of places like nah. this. These are a delicacy. No. They are healthy, nutritious, extraordinarily oh, high in protein. Oh my god! And apparently, they taste like walnuts. Kind of taste like cremated grasshopper. Oh but yeah, it does like, I can't eat that. This is what I'd be like, like I imagine digesting oh, someone's ashes. Well, you know yeah, what? I can't lie, that's not you great. I've been watching our celebrity, <laughs> yeah. And I thought, oh, that looks easy. I have to do that. <laughs> yeah, no okay, chance. I need a great cooked grasshoppers. Yeah, I can't do it. Uh, Why have I got I bugs in my mouth? Go on, boys, have a try. It's one of those once in a lifetime. Yeah. It genuinely just tastes try like it, Theo. Stop dry walnut. How is that once in a lifetime? They sell like pets at home. Yeah. Look at that. that. Oh, chill out, Theo, because I will eat someone. How do you eat it? What? You <laughs> eat the whole thing. There's eyes on them. That's still. what I mean. You want me to eat crickets or uh, grasshoppers' eyeballs? Come on, Ging. You're a grown it's, man. It's not right, though, is it? It looks weird. It's not right, though, is it? Why don't you just eat it and find out? No, mate, it's fucking. A vial. Go on, just go for it. It doesn't smell of it. It you really is on my tongue. I'm gonna know what it is. Cheers, bro. Yeah. Go on, guys. Cheers, go, on. Oh, go on, lad. Oh, they oh. are kissing. Cheers. Oh my god, look at that. Look at that. Oh, he's done it. He's done it. Oh, that's fucking disgusting. It's not great. It's it? really not good. It's so dry and wank. Oh, that Wait. tastes like charcoal. That does not taste like walnuts. I'll be honest, that was fucking disgusting. It's literally everything you'd expect in a dried in. <laughs> Arthur TV nuts son or side people balls daughter? What does that even mean? What does that even mean? I'm enjoying the idea though. No, Arthur, I'm not being funny. I just thought it'd be a unique experience. If you rock up to someone's for dinner and you'll get served crickets, not happy. Are you actually in a bit of a bad mood today? You seem like really grumpy. We actually do like having you here. <laughs> <laughs> no, we actually do. Uh, <laughs> You're being serious. I wish you'd consult the group before speaking. <laughs> oh my <laughs> god. Soldier. Yeah, that is crazy. I can't believe you've rocked up dressed like that. But other than that. <laughs> Should we see if we can get the fur of this tooth mark on a banana? Go on then, Theo. Deep throat that. Oh yeah. That's not actually. Is that it? <laughs> That's all you can get in there. Well, go on then. That's looked in my tip. I was going to say that was the size of my cock. <laughs> this is actually quite big, I thought. This is child's play. <laughs> oh no! What? I'm this now. Oh, you ah, uh, easy. <laughs> oh, Double it and give it back to me. Have you ever seen oh me God. regurgitate? Oh. Oh, Wait, that was cool. That was actually Did you have cool. A full banana? No. Shit. Is that the entertainment? What's the biggest thing you can do it with? <laughs> my testicles. That's not a star in my eyes, it was absolutely terrible. I liked that he was being different. I liked the creativity. This has still come down with me. I'm still looking to have a nice meal here. I'm not a fan of grasshoppers one bit. The crickets or whatever they were were literally disgraceful. It was appalling. It was shocking and it was miserable. But I thought it was nice. The boys probably tried something that they might never try again. Today's entertainment is going to be so positive. three fun science experiments. Starting with light-hearted fun, ending with a bang. So this is called an They're gonna firework. get banged. Please let me know when the firework begins. What happens now? Let me go. Oh! <laughs> Whoa! That is when the firework That was crazy. This is for Winston. Fly, daddies. <laughs> Good to know there's no fire alarm in here. Oh, I enjoyed that. They're so cute. Could step outside. It's time for experiment number two. Ooh. What so, is going on here? How does an elephant brush its teeth? Is this the elephant toothpaste thing? It is. Are we about to do a David Dobrik and blow up this entire garden? Here we go. Stand this back. is so stand fun. Back. I wish I was Actually, eating dinner there. So what I've done is I've mixed hydrogen peroxide. <laughs> he seems yeah. very stressed, with a squirt guys. Squirt of fairy liquid. Yep. Yes. Go, get back, get back. Oh. <laughs> That went crazy. Oh does it not just keep going? When does it go? Is that it? Is that oh, really? that isn't it, is it? Is that it, Arthur? Are you oh, being serious? Man. I'm not putting your face here. over it. There was supposed to be twice as much hydrogen peroxide, so it didn't really. Wait, Arthur, that's it? Well, that was the second one out of three. There's a third experiment. Oh, the third one's sick. <laughs> <laughs> that was, that was shit. fucking terrible. That was so bad. Well, if that Which historical figure throughout time would you choose to be? Um, I would probably be... Gary Heidnick. <laughs> I'd probably be Gary Heidnick. <laughs> your minds wait until you see what's next. So, for the exploding pie, we have all of this potassium nitrate. And then we're gonna have 280 grams of sugar if they thought the last one was boring. 
They are in for a treat here. And there we have it. Hopefully the pastry isn't hot enough to start setting it off now. All right, steak time. I'm gonna cook everyone's steak medium rare. Right? So it's all coming out at the same time. Oh, doesn't that look so fancy? Nah, I hate that guy. What? Siri, set a four minute timer for this. Okay, medium one What? No! Hello. Sorry, I, I asked Siri to set a four minute time. Wait! Wait, time. is that the TikTok guy? Oh my god, he's so funny! I love him! I literally love him! For some reason it called you. I'm in the middle of a chip come dine with me video, so say hi to the fans. I'll tell you to get fucked. <laughs> there we go. Hopefully, in a short amount of time, I have a nice juicy steak to serve everyone. I'm hungry, man. I can't be asked this shit. I need food. You need to cheer up. Daddy won't food. I'm not being funny, we've been here two and a half hours, we've eaten crickets. Theo, do you think you will do better than this, honestly? Yes. What are you gonna cook? I'll do Italian night. Yeah. Skiing oh. night at Prey. Oh. Yeah, I might do that. Ooh. Yeah, I'll do that. That'd, That'd be cool. I'm Weinstein! That's No, it's the song. I'm Weinstein! Oh. I don't think it's a song, I think it was a speech. What? From a certain dictator. <laughs> and I just wanna say he nailed it. <laughs> Garlic in there with them. Oh my, oh my god! god. So oh, I thought that would not be fuck me! They've got 10 minutes still to cook, so I think at the current temperature they should be pretty crispy by the time they're out. There's a lot of oil in there. Yeah, well, it's the goose fat that they're cooking in, but they kind of are like crispy chips. They kind of are supposed to be like almost deep fried. Is Sabina helping him? He, she's just gone, there's a lot of oil in there. Well, if it means I get my fucking food soon, then I'm not in the bottom. <laughs> when I walked in, she was cooking. Go, go have a look, Frosty. Oh, here we go, go. Deals inspecting, deals inspecting. That looks pretty red. Who's cooking here? Me. Are you making Josh's girlfriend cook for you? No. Are you sure? Because yes. we heard a lot of, there's too much oil in there. Hey, let me open this, let me do that. Yeah, and I said, there's not too much oil, it's goose fat. I just don't believe you. You can check the raw files. No, yeah, no, 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 don't eat that, don't eat that. Don't, do not eat that. Why? That is incredibly poisonous. Is that actually that? Like, actually, jokes aside, that will kill you if you try to eat that. What? Why? It, it genuinely, it, 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 you, 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 you can't know what's in it, it would be a cool, but that would genuinely kill you. What the hell? Wait, he's lying, right? Boys, we're just trying to eat. Oh, I think he might be murdering us. I picked up a bit of pastry. Yeah. And everyone screams at me saying, don't eat that. He says if I eat that, I would have genuinely died. Is, is it cold? Cold? It's just pastry. Fucking hell. Yeah. Well, I can't wait to dig Science into Science experiment dinner. pie? Oh. Oh. <laughs> but three minutes to go. I think it's time to start rolling out the dishes. So let's go serve some side salads. Gentle Dude, actually though, if I did this with Nikki, it would be hilarious because I would try so hard to cook the best thing ever and Nikki would actually probably end up killing me. Oh, food! Oh, the food is starting to come. Oh, oh, side salad. Oh my days. Salad is good. Very, very juices on top. I'm not gonna lie though. Like it looks. I don't like salad, but it looks good. It looks good, but I don't like the sauce. Give my thanks to Chip's girlfriend. <sighs> I've got a girlfriend. <laughs> so steak corn. <laughs> I think that looks nice. Whoa! Oh, oh, my oh, oh, oh dang! I tell you what, this that is looks looking good. It looks very right. nice. Thank you very much. It smells good as well. Oh, mine's raw. Uh, may we start, please? That's pretty That's good. Perfect. It's medium rare. Medium rare. I've never had a steak like that, so it's my first time that's trying not medium rare. Oh, Arthur, that's not medium that rare. That is not medium that's rare. That's very rare. Oh, Chip, that's rare, isn't it? Oh, that's definitely oh, that's rare. That's, that is rare. Oh, and I want to swap steaks. Uh, I actually can if you'd like me to. Or can I just swap steaks with you? You know what? Yeah, go on. I'm, pretty happy. I'm, I'm pretty happy with mine. This is really nice, though. The steak pretty is happy actually with lovely. Mine, pal. There you go. Thank I'll you. I think you've got mine right. I think that's what I usually have. It's really nice. Wait, I love the crisp. You need to stop having ketchup oh, on every fuck. meal. Oh, fuck. This is why you're not. Oh, my so God. Nice. I'm just getting chipped oh my God. one by one. Oh, my God. This is good, Arthur. Good yeah. work. Oh, thank you, man. What are you thinking? Why was that I so hard? Some tools are quite rocky. Yeah, yeah I, 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 like I'm biting pebbles. Yeah, tell Chip's girlfriend she did a great job with the steak. It's really good. She didn't touch the steaks. I'm go? glad she didn't handle another man's meat. <laughs> she stopped that now, has she? I'm really gutted you over. You overdid this steak, Arthur. I can't lie. Over. One's overdone, one's oh underdone. God. Fucking hell. 
Never satisfied, just <laughs> like your girlfriend. <laughs> oh. um, <clears throat> the candles are pretty. What's everyone's favorite period? <laughs> My girlfriend. Oh. Dinner time with extra sauce, come on. Hey. Should we start rolling out the dessert? Yeah. What the hell? So Stan, what do you want? <laughs> Decent. Uh, my steak was a little bit overdone, but we did swap steaks because the original one he gave me was very underdone. I had a nice, big, girthy piece of meat. Like, I, I've never seen anything like it before. <laughs> it actually was a very, very good steak. The steak was unbelievable. The side salad, I thought, was really nice as well. The wow. Steak was good. You just messed up the timings and how long each steak was cooked for. But we'll allow it because it's a tough job. The potatoes were absolutely rock solid. And he can sit there and go, that's not my fault. He was cooking. <laughs> uh, so as far as I'm concerned, that was his fault. And he will be pinned down for that. The Damn. potatoes, man, they tasted so... Number one to three. Uh... Number one to three. I think... I like three, I like three. Good, apart from the fact they were concrete slabs. Overall, I think that was pretty decent. Thank you all for enjoying my lovely meal. No, thank you for having us. Go Dessert? On. Yeah. What's going yeah. on with the audio Come here? On. Don't stress. Yes? Dessert? What oh, the fuck? Sorry, I don't like that sometimes. What the was that? Of entertainment and dessert, as far as they're aware. Exploding pie time. Oh, 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 shush, shush, shush. Dessert? Oh. Yep. And the final bit of entertainment for the night. Yes. Rolled into one. Is it edible? Can no, I... no, no. Absolutely not edible. So is come it? outside. What the f oh my god. Oh, right. He's <laughs> actually gonna kill right. someone. Sorry. Here we go. Oh. Wait, Wait, I can't even. Are you about to? Oh my Wait, god. Wait, Arthur, do we stand back? <laughs> yeah, she's a mad scientist. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I know. Instead of dessert, I'll make fire. <laughs> this will get me friends. Three. Two, one. The candles keep getting burned oh, well, out. Yeah. It's not even light. It's not going to light, it's, is it? It's a bit windy for this. <laughs> <laughs> What's happening? This is not another failed experiment, is it? It is, it is. Oh, wow. Oh, here we go, here we go. We've got it, I think. Here we go. Yeah, we go. Oh, here we go. Oh. oh. What is it? Oh, my God. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Oh. Wait, that's cool. Oh, 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 oh shit. Wait, Arthur, this is dangerous. What's Arthur, this is really dangerous. Look at all the smoke! Oh, the oh my god! Come around the other side! Is that meant to be the bloody yeah, What happened to our crumble? Oh my so god, bro! So what is it? Is it now? Oh, I was gonna eat some of that! Is it cooked now? Have you cooked it? Is that cooked? There we go! Ah. <laughs> I'm really confused about what. That, that looks so oh, dangerous! Right. No, that was cool though. Okay, it was kind of okay, cool. Then. Now I know you guys are probably having me, so that wasn't actually. Stan! Aww! What the heck, Stan? I'm gonna go over to Stan's house and we're gonna do a come dine with me. I'm gonna make Stan cook for me. <laughs> Thank you, Stan. I appreciate you. I hope you're doing well. Be the real dessert. Oh, yeah! yeah. yeah. Space apple pie and crumble. Yeah. Oh. Ooh. What space apple there is pie and a good crumble? Chance we'll all end up like Alex when we're older now, because that that was smoky. <laughs> Tried to make a bomb, but he ended up making a fire hazard. I actually did better experiments when I was in high school. <laughs> Genuinely. Yeah. I mean. What? A cool idea. I thought it was he cool. He just he set fire to a baking tray. It looked cool, but it did set my asthma off. But in the end, I think it fell a bit flat. Finally, Arthur I thought it was cool. With his dessert, radioactive robot apple pie, and custard. Absolutely typical. The final thing, something had to go wrong. We ran out of can openers. Never thought I'd be squeezing custard. What do you mean you ran out of can openers? What does that mean? Does it mean like they just didn't have one? Ran out of can openers? That doesn't make any sense. Kettle burgers don't like go bad. Doi, doi, doi. Cut the can like two, three, into the oven. And now all we have to do is stir the custard, heat it up quickly. Surely nothing can go wrong now. Wow. Like Shrek, Shrek just nutted into this pan. Ew. In fact, this is still heating up. So I'm going to plate up everyone's apple pie first. 
That looks so gross. I hope this doesn't taste weird. <laughs> it's ruined the flavor of everything. <laughs> it's so cold. Gentlemen. Oh, that yeah. looks so nasty. Yeah. Who's extra hungry and wants three? Oh, you can don't eat no taste. Oh, oh. OK, well, we'll oh. have it and don't eat it. What, so you've given it straight to Ginge because yeah, what's up it's in this? my left hand. <laughs> Why is what it green? Is what the this? fuck have you done? Oh, wow. Oh, I get that it. looks so <laughs> nasty. But I can, I can right, taste. I'm going to be honest, that actually smells <laughs> like hairspray. Yeah, I can smell paint. Is he made these? Are these shop bought? Has he made them? Oh my god, I can't eat that. Wait, is it edible? Taste it. That is so nice. That is good, bro. That is good. Did you actually make these? Did you shop bought them? You shop bought them. Shop bought them. Well, the shop, the apple pie is shop bought, yeah. That will be deducted in the point. Wait, 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 wait. Is the custard made by you? No. That made by Joshy. So what is made by you here? Well, the colouring. He put it in the bowl. He put it in the bowl. He put it in the bowl and sprayed yeah, it. Put it in sorry, the bowl and sorry. It. Can you not just no, say something? No, nice? no, no, no. I'm not having this. He made a cake from scratch. Yeah, yeah. fair enough. You've got shop bought apple pies and shop bought custard for dinner. What happened to the whole come dine with me? You're meant to be cooking. You've put shit in the microwave. Oh my goodness. I thought it was a really cool. You freaked out when you first saw it and you didn't think it tasted nice. That was um, the idea. Wait, but you just. What were you doing for the last 45 minutes? Since when? <laughs> what? Oh, oh yeah, just cooking, just cooking up a storm over there. I've <laughs> <laughs> slaved over the hot stove all day. No wonder your wife left you. Just what I get. I'm just slaving over the hot stove all day. <laughs> Wait. Wait, was Theo married before, or did a joke just go right over my head? I don't know. That was. Because if he was married before, that is messed up. That is so messed up to say. That is really messed up. But funny. I guess, I mean, they make fun of Calix for cancer, so. Robot pie. I said it in there and I'm not having it. Very controversial. It's kicked off. The robot pie, however, that was shit. The dessert was very nice. And credit to Mr. Kipling if you watch him. Theo is fuming. <laughs> when is he not fuming? He's just an upset human being. He's not had a fair life, has he? Oh, it's made a beautiful cake. <laughs> and Arthur from shop bought Mr. Kipling cakes. Not acceptable, will not be happening again. But it was very nice, the custard was very nice, and the spray paint was also very nice. Maybe I should have cooked one of them a bit more from scratch, but I feel like given I double cooked dessert, maybe I can get away with it. The man has cheated. I can't, I actually can't believe that you've not made I'm I don't know, I mean, he kind of cooked it, he colored it. You shop bought things in your corner. <laughs> yeah. 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 I hope you're milking the cow that provides <laughs> the <laughs> milk. You've created a problem for yourself. You're gonna get crucified. No, because he made his own. He made his own cake, which is respectable. And it was unbelievable. He smashed it. It was one of the best cakes I've ever had in my life. He's bought fucking pies from the shop. Yeah, true. All right, I'm just gonna get a microwave meal. And play Wasn't Chris and Dee's cake just like a store-bought like box cake? <laughs> Where'd you get them from? They're quite nice. Yeah, they are. They're Mr. Kipling apple pies. Daddy's been fed. Well, I enjoyed that, fellas. Thank you, Jasper, for joining me for my journey through time. Yes, no problem. <laughs> you speak normally. Oh, stop stop presenting to the fucking primary schools. Why primary? Why is it always yeah, kids? Why, why yeah. is it always kids? Why did you get like sort of tremor? No, because it's like he's a teacher. He's talking. To I think like he people. he heard one person once tell a pedo joke that got laughs, and ever since it's been like, <laughs> if I keep saying them, one of them will end up being funny. <laughs> <laughs> There's so I many to do my score now. <laughs> <laughs> to the scores! There's so oh, many to I think he did a good job. There was so much potential with Arthur's day, man. He had such great ideas and he just didn't really execute it that well. All in all, I think he did quite a good job of putting on, like he clearly put effort into it. My score is gonna be six. If you can see that, I think the store bar brought it down. I think that's really generous. I actually can't lie. I'd love to change it, but I'll give it now, so I'm going to stick with it. I had a good experience. I'm actually going to give him, and this is not me being biased. Maybe it is. I'll give him an eight. I feel like more, eight's understandable. Okay, so I I'm feel gonna... like he put a lot of effort into the ambiance and the theme, and everything was really cool. Everything was really cool. You know, maybe the potatoes were hard. I thought the steaks looked perfectly cooked because I don't like my steaks to be cooked. Um, and the science experiments, you know, they were science experiments. A tetoid, what? Give him a six, which I think is fair enough. Say, so well done, Arthur. You did a good job, but it wasn't anything special. Yeah. Damn. A bit like his YouTube channel, bless him.
I don't know if this is too harsh, but I'm going to score Arthur TV. Five. Overall, I think uh, a decently midnight, maybe five or six. And so with all okay. the results in, Arthur's scores on the doors accumulate to a middle of the road 25, edging Chris in a different way to usual. What was that? <laughs> what the? What the fuck? Yeah. Join us next time <laughs> when Theo Baker takes center stage with a Christmas themed corker. This time I'm making amends. Christmas theme, yay. Good video.